Well, for nearly 10 days now, people have been taking to the streets in Egypt protesting that country's leader. But right here in our own community, people want their voices to be heard as well. As we continue our coverage about the crisis in Egypt, News Channel 18's Aaron Leedy has more on a protest held this afternoon. Aaron. Jeff and Gina, good evening. Nearly 25 people, most of them students in Purdue's Egyptian student organization, gathered at Purdue's Memorial Mall this afternoon to raise awareness about the situation in Egypt. Many held signs asking for the president of Egypt to step down. Protest co-organizer Ahmed Amin is from Cairo. He says people are asking for basic human rights. He says the people want to put an end to a 30-year regime. The fact that you get more than 8 million people to go and uh, break the barrier of fear that the regime has implanted in every Egyptian's heart uh, is unprecedented. And uh, I believe if we do not get our freedom uh, these days and Mubarak does not resign now, nothing is going to change. Amin says he's been talking to his family in Egypt every day. At times, he says cell phones and the Internet were shut off, but he was still able to communicate using a landline phone. His family is fine, however, since they aren't that close to the protests in Cairo. Amin also has friends who are protesting in Egypt. He says one has been beaten by what he calls thugs, referring to the people working under President Mubarak's regime. Now, all of the people at today's protest at the Memorial Mall have family in Egypt. Aaron Leedy, News Channel 18.